um, for developing countries like uh, Africa, for example, um, this transition, how feasible is it in terms of the cost for these governments to manage uh, this transition from, uh, uh, from the current uh, fossil fuel to uh, renewable energy? Would that be uh, something that these governments could manage? Because definitely uh, it would invite uh, maybe additional skilled labor to manage the turbines and even the plants to actually manufacture those uh, uh, gadgets are not there in place yet. Right. And uh, the investment on that, I'm not sure how the governments in those developing worlds could, uh, uh, could manage. Yes, good question. I think one of the keys here, first of all, we in the industrial world need to be the role models. We need to be doing these things on a scale that's needed. If that's the case, then the cost of the renewable sources will come down further and make them accessible to more people in the world. Um, but our aid program should be focusing on this. The World Bank is still making loans for coal-fired power plants in developing countries, for example. Um, the reason the World Bank is run by economists, not by ecologists. Um, they need some good ecologists in there to interact with the economists and, and, and get them to incorporate the indirect costs as well as the direct costs, as I discussed uh, earlier. Um, but this is an area where aid programs can play a major role. And, and the neat thing about renewable sources of energy is that they're relatively simple technologies. It's not like building nuclear power plants, for example. Um, and and, and the, the energy sources are local. And this is very much to the economic advantage of almost any country, whether it's Nigeria or the United States. I mean, Nigeria is a special case with oil, but many other African countries would have to rely on solar energy, um, importantly, or, or wind energy. Um, interestingly, the third ranked country now in wind generating capacity in the world is India, which is a developing country. So they're moving very fast.